The pictures of the abuse are so disturbing, we've blurred the compound fractures in the pelican's wings. Experts at the Wetlands and Wildlife Care Center in Orange County say the count is now at an alarming 32 cases. The injured birds have been discovered since October with broken wings. Elizabeth Wood is the vet who is trying to save them. He went straight into emergency surgery to flush all of the debris out of the open wound. So bone was protruding through the skin and the wing was actually um, twisted all the way around, probably because the bird had been in surf. That pelican could not be saved. Sadly, most brought in for emergency care have died. The animals have been found in a concentrated area stretching from San Clemente to the southern part of Huntington Beach. The question is, who is committing these brutal attacks on pelicans? They would actually have to have a hold of the bird and be able to do something really hard, you know, to break it, because that's a good sturdy bone. People on the beach were unaware that someone is purposely breaking pelicans' wings. It's just sad to see that someone would, like, show that kind of, like, disrespect and just, like, uh, cruelty towards nature and like something that's done nothing towards them. I mean, I wonder if it would be like fishermen, you know, maybe on the pier, like um, competing with the, you know, when the pelicans come and um, grab what they're catching. I, I don't know. It's terrible. I hope they find them. A special hotline has been set up for the public to call if they know anything. There's also a $500 reward. Wildlife experts say their total is now 32 pelicans with broken wings, but they say it's possible it's happened to many more. In Newport Beach, Michelle Geely, CBS 2 News. Going hiking.